Union Test Prep's Pharmacy Tech Practice Test, Prescription Labels and Drug Classes. Question 1. How would you interpret the following order? A. One tablet by mouth twice daily for three days. B. Two tablets by mouth three times daily for three days. C. Two tablets as needed up to three times a day for three days. D. Two tablets by mouth twice daily three times a day. The correct answer is B. Two tablets by mouth three times daily for three days. Let's break the order down. In prescription shorthand, two I's is representative of two. Tab is shorthand for tablet. PO is derived from the Latin paras, which translates roughly to by mouth. TID is shorthand for three times a day. And the D in 3D is shorthand for day. Question two. What does the term Cigna or SIG refer to? A, directions for use. B, ingredients. C, pharmacist signature or D, instructions for the pharmacist. The correct answer is A. The term Cigna, or SIG, in a prescription refers to the directions of use for the patient. This includes information such as the purpose of the drug, how to take it, orally, nasally, rectally, etc., how much of the drug to take, when to take the drug, and for how long. It should also include any warnings or special instructions for use, such as keep refrigerated or shake well. Question 3. What does the abbreviation SS mean? A. One half. B. Without. C. Soon. Or D. Suppository. The correct answer is A. One half. This comes from the Latin semis, which means one half. Question 4. An NDC number reads 08973-5567-40. What does the first five-digit number refer to? A. The drug. B. The patient. C. The pharmacy. Or D. The manufacturer. The correct answer is D. The manufacturer. NDC, or National Drug Code Numbers, appear on every prescription bottle to better help identify the product. The first five digits refer to the manufacturer, the second four digits to the drug product, and the last two digits indicate package size. Question 5. What is the true expiration date of a drug that is said to expire 3 2020? A. March 31st, 2020. B. March 30th, 2020. C. March 1st, 2020 or D, April 1st, 2020? The correct answer is A, March 31st, 2020. The true expiration date of a product is always the last day of the listed month. Question six, if you needed to learn about drugs that are therapeutically equivalent, what would be your best reference? A, Red Book, B, Remington's Pharmaceutical, C, Physician's Desk Reference, or D, The Orange Book? The correct answer is D, the Orange Book. Red Book discusses the wholesale pricing of prescriptions, Remington's Pharmaceutical discusses compounding, and the Physician's Desk Reference, or PDR, contains general information on drugs, mostly provided by drug manufacturers. Question 7. Drug recalls are categorized into classes that indicate the severity of the recall. Which class refers to a situation where a patient is not likely to be harmed by contact with a recalled drug? A, Class 0 Recall. B, Class 1 Recall. C. Class 2 Recall or D. Class 3 Recall? The correct answer is D. Class 3 Recall. There are three drug recall classes labeled 1, 2, and 3. Class 3 refers to a situation where exposure to the drug will likely not cause harm, whereas Class 1 presents a situation where exposure will very likely cause harm or even death. Question 8. A prescription label reads the following. How many tablets would you need to fill this order? A. 60 B. 76 C. 80 or D. 92 You may want to pause the video here to solve the problem. The correct answer is C. 80. If the patient is able to have two tablets at every dose and up to four doses a day, remember there are 24 hours a day and they can have the tablets every six hours, so 24 divided by six is four times a day. Two tablets per dose times up to four doses per day times 10 days equals 80 tablets. For more free practice tests, study guides, and flashcards for the pharmacy tech exam, check out uniontestprep.com forward slash PTCB pharmacy technician certification exam.